right guys welcome back got an exciting one today got the opportunity recently to go out fishing for triple tail and managed to get this nice one he's been sitting on ice so he's a little light colored right about 21 inches caught him on a split shot with shrimp um, we were out fishing for him I was fishing with a guy who's famous around here for getting triple tail he can literally smell them you'll be coming out to a spot and he'll say I smell triple tail and no kidding plug a shrimp out on a split shot and you got one and I'm not lying we caught three keepers we had um, probably four or five that are borderline so we just let them go but probably could have kept two um, and then 10 each shorts not even kidding so 25 triple tail we probably caught today so now I'm gonna flay this one up and we're gonna do a Parmesan crusted dish it's very good very easy triple tail has quickly become my favorite fish to eat and I'm gonna show you why all right same thing with any fish I'm pull this back fan go along its head it's a big girl straight down to its belly cut over slowly and then I'm gonna run along its back, run along its belly, and flip it over. I'll show you guys that in a second. All right, as I'm finishing this up, I wanted to tell you a little bit more how we target these. So we were fishing Jeff's secret spot, and he just has a bunch of little areas that he goes to frequently that he knows, like the back of his hand. And he'll tell you the best thing or the best thing you could use for triple tail is just a big live shrimp, a small circle hook, and a split shot. And that's all it takes. If we weren't seeing these fish. Um, obviously, we were searching for them, but we weren't seeing them. He says, he says if you see them, they see you, and you're not going to hook into them. Look at that piece of meat. Ugh, triple tail is one of my favorite fish to eat. So, split shot, live shrimp, know your area, know where you're targeting. Um, this guy put in work. He's been fishing for triple tail, targeting these fish for 10 years. They, he practically owns this, the triple tail fishery here in Tampa. So I can't thank him enough. Thank you, Jeff, for taking me out with, taking me out with you today and showing me the ropes because uh, I never would do the things that he's doing for him. And this was, I mean, he got a 30 incher the other day, a couple weeks ago. This one's 20. Look at the size of this piece of meat. So. I see why he targets them. All right. What's up, guys? Welcome back to Real Florida Fish Channel. I got a nice triple tail. You guys saw me fillet it. Um, caught this with Jeff Groves, local legend split shot and shrimp and now it's going straight to the oven um first thing i'm going to do we got these pretty dry but i'm going to pat up dry them a little bit more cut it but this is just one half of the fish um one half of well it's one fillet one half of the fish patting it dry real good i'm going to squeeze some lime over it just anything citrus uh lemon would work fine obviously I like lime. Lime is a preference of mine. So got this nice triple tail fillet. Squeeze some lime over the top. Set it on your baking sheet. And we're gonna pop this in the oven. We got it at a broil at 550 degrees. Okay, we're gonna do this for about five or six minutes while we make up our mix. Right in this middle sheet. Set timer, five minutes. I use the microwave. And now we're gonna prepare our mix. So, um, we have mayonnaise here. This looks like butter. Mix the butter. My hands are clean, I promise. And we got breadcrumbs. We, uh, I use panko breadcrumbs for this. Get a little mix. I'll just use a fork. Alright, adding a uh, two-third cup Parmesan cheese. You could use fresh 
Romano is probably the best bet. And we got some Worcestershire sauce. Just a dash of Worcestershire sauce. A little bit of Louis down up here. Hot sauce, whatever you prefer. Just a dash again. And then some salt and pepper to taste. And mix this up real good. Go ahead, you can start there. All right, we broiled it at 550. We did six minutes and we got our mix, our Worcestershire sauce, salt, pepper, panko breadcrumbs, and Parmesan cheese. And we're just gonna coat the top of this. Look at that, it's already cooked nice and white. Oh yeah, yeah it gonna, looks good. Just so, pile it on there. Just pile it on yeah. there. Yeah. And you'll make it even. Chef Jordan over here. Oh yeah, Ryan made a surprise appearance. Our kids were playing in the backyard. What's up? So he came over to see what I was doing. He ordered Mexican food. He didn't want any triple tail tonight. I'll probably try some, but the wife wanted Mexican, so we had to make that happen. We're going fishing later tonight, so. We're gonna go out for some tarpon, hopefully. Hopefully. Drive all the way down to Bradington for it. Shh, don't give away the spot. We're driving down all the way to Bradington for it. <laughs> I gotta say, the mastermind behind cooking is my brother. Our dad was a chef, and I did not pick up the patience for cooking, but he did. All right, how's that look? Looks dash, great. Dash of what? Breadcrumbs. Okay. Sprinkle it on top. All right, sprinkle some breadcrumbs on top. So we'll... I gotta go, I'm being summoned. I'll catch you all. All right. There you go. There you go. Now we're gonna put this in back in the oven. Same thing, 550 degrees for six minutes, two minutes, two minutes. Smells so good. All right, we broiled for a couple more minutes. I like my fish crispy. No one came in to jet, uh, join us. He's just riding his bike through the kitchen. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn off this oven, and you guys can take a look at what it looks like. Pull it out. Mind you, that's one half filet. You got the breadcrumbs nice and crispy on the top. You got nice and white. Triple tail is one of my favorite fish to eat, and this is why. So, we're just gonna eat this as is. We're not, we didn't cook anything spectacular with it. It's just how much we like fish. So, thank you guys for tuning in. It's Real Florida Fishing Channel. And this is Parmesan encrusted triple tail. Thanks. Like, comment, subscribe. Like, comment, subscribe. Go ahead and cut into this for you. Flaky white fish.